Everybody, today we're reacting to um, Henry Sees Red. I don't know what this is about, so I do not own Thomas and Friends, but let's go, go, go. Laughing at me earlier today. He said I looked ridiculous with all this coal on me, but I can't help it. How could I know that coal suddenly came out of the hopper at Tidmouth when I was waiting there? Oh, Rebecca, don't worry about it. It's not that bad. Let me tell you, being painted in a red under- For the last time, Logan, don't jump my passenger coach so hard against me. Yo, everything in good time, man. You would know the importance of it if you actually pulled these electric coaches a disrespectful engine. <laughs> oh my! Connor certainly has seen red. <laughs> Those two aren't the best of friends, I think. <laughs> red, that's funny. Um... Well, let me tell you a story to make you cheer up a bit. Trust me, being covered in coal dust is not as bad as needing to take the express in a bright undercoat. Undercoat? Well, some time ago, I was sent to the works to get an overhaul. While I was there, the workmen painted a so-called undercoat on me to help the paint dry faster. They painted me completely red. Oh, jeez. <laughs> now, don't look so offended, Henry. You aren't going to stay red for long. Oh, yes, I know that. But I just hope no one sees me right. Oh, hello, Henry. Uh, Reneus, oh, no. Well, I must say it's a good choice of color. Red really suits you, just like me. <laughs> Never mind. Well, looks like we're done with the undercoat, Henry. We will come back to you after a nice cup of tea. Yes, sir. Oh, Henry, I'm so glad you're still here. James was supposed to take the express, but he has derailed himself in the yard. We need you to take over the express. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, I painted red. Everyone will laugh at me. Now, now, Henry. It's not the end of the world. You're a really useful engine, even when you're painted in a different color. Fine, then. I, I will go. Poor Henry! Everyone's gonna laugh at him, even Percy! A new engine? No, Percy. It's me, Henry. <gasps> Henry? Is that really you? You're all red! <laughs> oh, dear. I wonder where James is. Never mind. Found him! <laughs> Ignore them, Henry. I'm glad that you could help me out. Now, off you go then. You can't have the express being late. Right, sir. Everyone needs to leave him alone. I just remind James how he was pink. You should remember the time James was left in pink. It's not that, that bad. <sighs> so well that reaching the top went very smoothly. For the rest of the journey, I forgot I was even painted red and delivered the express to its destination right on time. Whoa, what a cool story! Thanks for telling me, Henry. You really are a, well, an enterprising engine, you could say. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's Nothing really. <laughs> oh, there you go. Starting to become red again. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was interesting. I have no words. Like, I knew James went through something like that. But to see another engine go through it, that was. That was interesting. <laughs> I liked it. Thank you to the person who told me to react to it. Um, the next episode, I believe, I'll react to is uh, Percy's Sees Happy. Or I don't know. I can't remember what it's called. Anyways, thank you for watching, everybody. Uh, I do not own Thomas and Friends, but tell everything. This is K Bear 101. Signing out. Adios, everybody.